I'm a student at the University of Edinburgh and I'm a second year. I'm taking English literature and I just thought that I would start this to help out any international students or even students from the UK considering coming here. I love it and I just thought I would start making videos about it to show people how much I like it. <laughs> well, last video that I posted, it was one of the trips that I took this year in February and currently it's March 3rd and this week I decided to start filming like a little week in my life video because I've seen a lot of people doing those and I found them to be like really helpful when I was deciding whether to come here for school. It's gonna start on Wednesday, March 1st and end Wednesday, March 8th, 7th. I'm sorry, I'm not a math major, so yeah. <laughs> also, I forgot to note this in the intro, but it is like a week with a lot of strike days. So that's why you're not really seeing me in class a lot. So my schedule was like pretty light. I think I only had like four classes total within this week that I'm showing you. I will do another one with like an actual class schedule week where I like go to all my classes and there's no strike days, but this one's just like really light. Good morning. It is currently 8.45. I'm getting ready to go on a hike with Amy. We're gonna go to the Pentland Hills. I don't know why I said it like that. The Pentland Hills. And then there's like this vintage pop-up in St. James Quarter, which is like the mall here. And we're gonna go do that too. Um, and I got like a ticket, so it's an extra 10% off because I need that at poor. <laughs> this is my hiking outfit. Ah -ha -ha. Um, Wearing my Levi's again because they're the only jeans that fit me right now because I started working out and it's altered my body. <laughs> um, and then the top is from Free People. It's like really all on the ground on eBay. And yes, this is not really a hiking outfit, but also it kind of is because the Pentland Hills is like super easy. <laughs> Matilda, she doesn't want to go on a hike, but we're gonna make her come. <laughs> so Matilda didn't really want to go on this hike, but we decided to go to her house and surprise her because we thought it would be really fun for us all to go and get outside and it would be good for like our mental health because it's been like pretty gloomy here. So we went to her house, which was actually a huge like diversion from our route. It was gonna take us probably 40 minutes to get to the Pentland Hills from Amy's house. But then we went to Matilda's and that took us, it like added a good two hours to our little day. But I'm glad we did because she did end up deciding to come. We took like an hour and a half to get over here, but we're finally by Matilda's house. I don't really know where we are, it's in Craigleaf. <laughs> in Craigleaf. We got some Greg's sausage rolls. That was my first one I've ever had. And I've lived here for like a year and a half. Um, there's a really pretty tree. The numbers are going up, wait. <laughs> I was about to show you her house. We found it. It's giving Joe Goldberg. Look at my hair. We're just walking up to it. This is scary and I feel bad. George is vlogging. Oh my goodness, look at that. <laughs> Matilda's coming with us. We kind of scared her, but we found her house. So slay. <laughs> It was fun. 
we're hiking Pentland Hills. And look at the horses. <laughs> They're so cute. Pony. Yeah, she did. I did. She petted it hard. Thank you. What? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Look at that. These ones don't care about us. Where 
we're actually meeting tomorrow again, and we're gonna go to this little like clothing swap event that's at the Black Medicine Coffee Shop, which is one of my favorites. They have really good coffee and really good vegan sandwiches. I'm not vegan, but sometimes I try to eat vegan because it makes me feel good. <laughs> oh, and then we're gonna go book shopping because we both need some new books to read. We're both English literature majors, so that's why. Good morning! It is Saturday and it's 9.30. I woke up like an hour ago and I've been on TikTok since I woke up. Super productive, I know. And I'm gonna meet Lily on South Bridge. Also, look how sunny it is. Like, look. history midterm because it's going so badly as you can see i got home and i just dumped all my stuff on my bed that's clean girl aesthetic right there i got one thing at that clothing exchange and i brought four this is her this is my little my little romper this is my little romper um the back is so cute I will be wearing this all summer long. Like, look at the little ballerina. It's night time. Delicious. Don't come for me in the comments. Nobody will. I have seven subscribers, so. I slept for like almost 10 hours. Normally I sleep for eight and for some reason oversleeping absolutely murders me. <laughs> I'm about to get ready to go meet this girl for coffee that I met last week and she's actually gonna take over the lease for my flat because I'm not staying here over the summer. I'm going home. I actually wanted to stay here over the summer but it's not a good financial move. And I wanna get an internship for my publishing career. So I need to go home. Anyways, and I'm gonna read 
the guild series by raven kennedy i'm almost done with the first book and it's really good so i'm excited happy monday i am so tired kylie called me last night at 1 a.m and i thought she was having like an emergency but it was because she saw the northern lights in dublin and last time that happened last weekend while we were in italy um people could see them here too but i looked outside and there was nothing but i'm glad she called me because like if they had been here i would have wanted to know today i have one lecture for literature and then a tutorial for literature as well. If you don't know, a tutorial is basically like a small class where you discuss what you've been learning. And Lily's in both of them, so that'll be fun. And then I also have this huge pile of books I have to go donate somewhere because they're taking up so much room. Most of them are from my course. Next time I will be getting them on Kindle if they have the right edition. I did get a really yummy little lemon tart before I went and I ate that in the sun while I read my book on Kindle. I finished Guild and now I'm on to Glint, which is the second book in the Gilded series by Raven Kennedy. And it's really good! Not surprising because everybody told me it was good. Anyways, it's still really sunny outside. There's a soccer game on the meadows, so I might go outside and like read out there. And then I'm gonna make some salmon for dinner. I'm skipping another day of the vlog. Tuesday was stupid. I had a lecture at 10 a.m. I went to the gym and then I sat in my flat and I read all day. Super boring, so we're skipping it. <laughs> Happy Wednesday. <laughs> I'm so tired. I read half of Glint last night and that is why I look like this. This is what I'm wearing. My little sweater from eBay slash Brady Lovo, and then my cargo pants from Urban Outfitters. Today I have one class and it's a seminar, so it's two hours long, and it's for crime and detection in literature. And we're gonna be talking about the girl with the dragon tattoo because that's what we're reading right now. And then I'm just gonna go to the library for a couple hours and work on my midterm for our history which is also my final essay, which makes no sense. But whatever. history essay in two hours so going to the library it actually helps because I was working on it for a few days and I made like no progress and then today I wrote 1500 words in two hours and I was like oh I could have just come to the library sooner and finished it it looked really nice outside and then it was negative two celsius which is like a good 30 degrees fahrenheit but yeah that was a week in my life thanks for watching subscribe if you liked it. I'm gonna do another one where I have like a bigger course load during the week just because we have strike days right now and this was like my lightest week so but yeah thanks for watching